In this video, you'll learn how to create electric title animation. To ease the creation process, I will use the Sonic template from the Movie Titles set. In the template, I delete unnecessary elements and leave only the Sonic word and blue light sparkle on the edge of the letter O. The first step would be to change the word to the one you like. For this, select all the layers with the word Sonic, and from the text tab of the inspector, change it to I got the power, written in three lines. I will then adjust font size, kerning, and line spacing to make sure that the word length in each line is the same. The light sparkle will likely float off the letter edge as you change the text, so I drag it to the lower left corner of the letter H foot. Now I'm done with preparing the electric text effect that will be animated in the next steps. Next, I bring up the animation panel and add the first keyframe. While the first keyframe is selected, I open the Layers panel and select the top four layers, one light sparkle, and three text layers. Then I pull the opacity slider to the leftmost position in the Effects tab of the Inspector panel to make these layers invisible. After that, I add a second keyframe in which I make the same four layers visible again by pulling the opacity slider to the rightmost position. In addition to that, I will need to shift the electricity effect along the text. For this, I adjust the x-axis texture position for mask and displacement distortions for all of the top three text layers. Also, I'll have to move the light sparkle to the right along the bottom line of the letter H foot, somewhere in the middle. As a result, the animation will display the light slowly starting to glow due to increased opacity and sliding to the right. Now I add the final keyframe and set the opacity for the top four layers back to 0%. Similar to the keyframe two steps, I further adjust the x-axis texture position for mask and displacement distortions for the top three text layers. And also I move the light sparkle further to the right so it stays at the right end of the H letter foot. I will preserve keyframe transition settings as is and export the animation.